Hey, this is Clint from the Doorway 2, hanging out and doing a, another one of those reviews you like so much. Uh, this one, I'm doing a little bit differently. I want it to be dark and creepy, because it's a dark and creepy record that I'm going to be real talking about. It is a band called Megalophobe. They are on Nefarious Industries, and it came out today, December 18th. The album is called Music for Resistant Fantasies, or Music for Resistance Fantasies. And I, from what I'm reading, it's uh, uh, from 2019, and it was a piece made for a dance competition or a dance uh, uh, event uh, in 2019. And uh, it really sounds like a creepy horror movie soundtrack, so I'm not really sure where the hell it came from being for a dance uh, composition or piece. Uh, gentleman's name is Ben that does this, uh, and again, it's on Nefarious Industries. Rather than keep rambling on, let's listen to the first track, which is called Dreamy. <laughs> Like I said, it sounds more like a creepy uh, piece for an art exhibit or a, a short film of a lo-fi sci-fi and creepy horror uh, eerie soundtracks. Uh, this is not the normal metal stuff I do, I know, but I love a lot of dark ambient, experimental, and noise stuff, as you guys know. So I uh, thought, why the hell not review this one? Uh, let's listen to another song. Uh, let's listen to track three. Uh, and remember, this is a six-song record. Uh, it's called Noisy.
like I said, it's kind of a noisy, dark ambient soundscape that's just unsettling and nerving and creepy. Uh, so the more and more I listen to it, the, the more and more I'm digging it. Uh, the cool thing about this record is um, everything but the last song has so words that end in Y. Tracks like dreamy, airy, noisy, spacey, voxy. Uh, and then the last track is uh, the dreamy reprise. Uh, so uh, it's just a reprise of the original track, I think. Uh, anyway, six songs. Really kind of cool. Um, definitely don't know how you dance to it. Uh, so I'm not really sure how that was an installation piece for a dance thing. It must have been really avant-garde and different. Uh, but this is a, a one-man project by a guy named Ben. Uh, again, uh, Megalophobe is the name of the band. Uh, and I, if I remember, Music for Resistant Fantasies uh, is the name of the record. Out on Nefarious Industries today, December 18th. It's digital and it's limited to a 50-run cassette. So if you haven't gotten it, you're probably not going to get it. Um, but let's listen to another track. Uh, this is track number four and it's called Spacey. tracky uh music concrete kind of very avant-garde music like this it's just really cool to me uh i love the experimentation of different sounds noises field recordings drones drifts things like that uh let's listen to one more track which is track five uh from megalophobe and it is a song called voxy
I said, unsettling, haunty, creepy, cinematic, dark ambient with lots of avant-garde elements. Uh, Megalophobe album is called Music for Resistance Fantasies, and it's on Nefarious Industries, came out today. Uh, limited to a 50-run cassette and digital on all formats. I will put links to their band camp, uh, to Nefarious Industries site, so you can check out this band and other things they do, because the label is impressive. Uh, really love the dark ambient side of this, and feels really good to kind of listen to something like this on a windy, cold night here in uh, Arizona. Anyway, if you like what I do, like and subscribe to Facebook and uh, YouTube pages. And uh, say uh, a little word about uh, Epileptic Santa here for me. Uh, and uh, again, Clint from the Doorway too. See ya.